welcome to Free Dictionary Friday. I'm E.T. Tutor and this is a special video for 2019 GCSE English language students who are sitting their exams next week. So I spotted the quotation of the day and what I thought we could do is just unpick it in the same way that you'll be unpicking text within your exam papers. So this one is from Henry James a uh, Victorian writer, um, very Hello and welcome to Free Dictionary Friday, I'm E.T. Tutor and this is a special video for any 2019 GCSE English language students who are sitting their exams next week. So what I thought we could do is have a look at the quotation of the day and try and unpick it, try and analyse it in the same way that you're analysing text within the exam. So from Henry James, the right time is any time that one is still so lucky as to have. Okay. So first things first, can you think why I thought this was a good quotation for you GCSE students doing your exams next week based on the quote? The right time is any time that one is still so lucky as to have. Yeah, you're still lucky. If you're watching this on the Friday, on the Saturday, on the Sunday, you've still got time. You can still, re still prepare and you can still make a real difference on the potential results you'll get so check out the channel in full have a look at the playlist if this is one of the first times you've been here and hopefully you'll be able to find what you need if not just get in touch and i'll try and get back to you so are there any language devices you can see within this quotation hopefully you've spotted an easy one there's the repetition of that word time. So it's showing us that that's something very significant here. And that's what the whole quote is about. It's about motivating people to use the time they have and appreciate the time they've got. Anything else? Okay. I would suggest it's quite a good example of sibilance. Now, if you're not sure what sibilance is, I have made a video about that, so you can check that out. Hopefully, if you don't know what sibilance is, you know what alliteration is. So, that's that repetition of the consonant sounds. Sibilance is just repetition of the letter S. So, can you spot those S words? Okay, so we've got is, still, so, as. So... When we read this out loud, the right time is any time that one is still so lucky as to have. We can hear that repetition of the S and what it does here is slows down the pace. So hopefully you could see that an argument could be made that because this quotation is all about the passing of time, by slowing down the pace, James is attempting to make us slow down our thinking and reflect on the time that we have. Okay, so it's a good example of that. People can often spot these devices, but they don't know how to explain why they're being used or potential reasons that they're being used. So hopefully that example will help. Best of luck to you all over the next few days and best of luck during the exams. If you found the video helpful at all, if you've learned anything, please hit like. It'll just show others that it's worth a watch. All right then, bye for now.